Hey, baby, looking for some action? I don't think they got a needle big enough to kill the shit you got, baby. Well, you can kiss mine. Say what? Nothing, man, nothing. Don't get uptight. Yeah, give me a uh, Coca-Cola with a cherry. You got the bread? You got the stuff? It's under the sugar bowl. I need some more. How much more you want? About eight bills. You got the bread on you? I can get it, but I gotta call my main man. Get on. Is that the dude? Yeah, that's him. What's the matter? JC, why do you bother me with the small time shit? Not small time shit. The guy bought 300, he wants 800 more. That's 1100. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's still small time shit. Don't worry, he's cool. He's a fucking pimp. He loves to party. You know how he are. There's something about this I don't like. Huge. Money first. I'll get it. Hey. I don't trust nobody. Go, Slim. Raise punk. No move. Easy, man. Ah, uh, shut up. You know the routine. Let's just take it easy. Up against the wall. Go low, sucker. <laughs> Think you needed any? Yeah. You no, know, you cost me five bucks. Pay the man. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, You're really stupid. You know that, JC? You're really, a, really it's stupid. It's a meatball wrap. You got your brains in your ass. That's for you. You're wasting your time, pig. You know that, don't you? Shit. I'll be back on the street before sunset. Yeah. You'll be on the street, all right. Face down if you don't get your butt in the car. Bullshit. You shit if you eat right now. Man, get in the yeah. goddamn car. Oh, shit, your hands. Come on! Like I said before, you're wasting your time, sucker. <laughs> The rest you can go home. That's all. You got something in mind? Yeah, a recommendation for a promotion would be nice. When I think you've earned promotion, I hope she'll be the first one to know. Gee, you know how long we've been trying to nail Goldie Jackson? Okay, before you guys break your arms, patting yourselves on the back. Let's see what the DA says. In case you forgot, we nailed Jackson before. And he got off the lack of evidence. We got the evidence. So I repeat, good arrest. Then why don't you go on home and uh, let me get back to my work, huh?
You ready for ten bucks on the Bears? On the Bears? They couldn't win if the score was 90 to nothing in the fourth quarter. Yeah, you're gonna eat those for it. Looky, looky. A dynamic duo. Henry Hoff will come down to bail out his meal ticket. That's the cop that busted me. You got a name, cop? Look, I'll tell you something, Hooks. I don't appreciate you harassing my clients. One of these days is going to be you, Hoffman. But only you're going to go up for a long, long time. Keep dreaming, cop. By the way, anytime you want a nickel bag, Hooks, just let me know. I'll give you one on the house. Get in the damn car. You know what the trouble is with you, Dick Tracy? You take your job too damn seriously. Frank. I bet you think you're something really bad, don't you? Well, you ain't shit. You ain't nothing but a big, stupid ass pig. Frank! Damn it, pick up. Come on, get in the car. Get in the car. Man, you had to touch my wife again. I had you up on the chair. Put the chair down. I'll you in the face for a football. Jesus Christ, you really did it this time. Are you stupid or what? Think because you wear that badge, you can punch anybody you want? You had it coming. Jesus Christ. Did you have to do it right in front of his lawyer? I was pissed. That's no goddamn reason. Look, we've been trying to nail Goldie for a month. It's in two hours, he's out on bail. He'll probably get off with a suspended sentence. But those are the breaks. You think I want to let Jackson go any more than you do? But it's the law, Frank. We're cops. We got to go by the law whether we like it or not. Now, the commissioner wants me to put you up on charges. And I'm not going to oblige him because I think it'll look bad for the department. So because of that, I'm going to let it drop. On one condition. What? You apologize. To who? Goldie Jackson and his lawyer. Oh, shit. Now, I'm not giving you a choice. Look, I'm out there on the street busting my ass every day to get these punks off the street, and now you want me to apologize to one of them? Like hell. Now, look, Frank. You tell Jackson and his faggot lawyer to kiss my ass. Well, he had it coming. You take it all too personally. It's a joke. Cops are a joke. I mean, we're just going through the motions. You know who the law protects? Goddamn lawbreakers. Why are you here? See you. Every time you get a horny, you come over here to get laid. This time it's different. This time I want to stay. Frank, if I thought you were serious. Oh, and I know what you're hungry for, too. <laughs> Hello. How's my boy? I know you're hungry, but you will have to wait till I see that big bad man over there. Just be a little patient. I 
swear one of these days I am going to be strong enough to say no. Well, as long as it ain't now. You sure all that stuff is hidden here, huh? All I know is what the chief in Washington told me. I want you to make sure it doesn't get on the street. It's your operation, Frank. Okay, sounds good to me. I'm telling you, man, all that shit hits the street. All the small busts we make won't barely put a dent in that goddamn operation. Yeah, well, maybe we'll get lucky. Get the buyer and the seller. And we'll make a big score. Yeah, I heard that. Ain't that our old friend Cheech? Yeah, hey, the dude sure is in a hurry, ain't he? I've never seen him walk that fast. He's another shining example of our courts at work. I mean, we just busted this clown three months ago. Look at that, he's back on the street again. Jesus. Hey, I wonder if he's clean. I'll talk to him. Let's do it. Right there, Cheech. And the next one will be right up your ass. Jesus, it's open. Okay, okay, so, so we make a deal, okay? Join, I'm a class X felon. They don't throw the key away. Look, I, I don't want to do no time. Not if I can save my skin. So what you got, Cheech? We deal, okay? Don't make promises. Tell us what you got first. Big bag going down in a few days. How big? Ten mil. Ten mil? Where they get that much shit from? Comes in from overseas. You mean all that stuff gets dumped here in Chicago? That and more. Then I'll be lying to us, Chief. Hey, man, this is the truth. What about a deal? If the stuff gets dropped here and if we catch him. A lot of ifs, brother. That's the way it is, my man. Now you take it or leave it. Now where's this bag take place? Well, they drop the stuff off in Canada to some dude. And it's shipped here and they pay for it. They usually drop a meal deposit. And they check the stuff out. Where? Like, where? I don't know. If you put me on the streets, <laughs> I can find out. Okay, Cheech. I'm gonna tell you something, brother. The next time, I won't shoot in the air. All right, I want to hear from you every hour. Don't you ever get tired of eating that shit? Shit! Hey, bro, this is dingly special. Another thing, my man Cheech called me. Told you not to worry. So? Told us to come meet him. That's so good, why don't you give me some? Stuff is being delivered tonight. 
sure of this? Hey, man, I wouldn't shoot you straight up. I got a lot riding on this thing, like my ass. Need some backup. Car 14, Detective Davis here, need an assist. Drug stakeout, southwest corner of Cermak and Michigan. It's 7 a.m. in the morning. We've been here all night. Yeah, yeah, I know. What's the matter? You get nervous? <clears throat> Hell no, man. I'm just bored. I'll just hang in there. Pete. Pete. God damn it, wake up. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. I've almost run out of apple juice, though. Well, don't get too drunk. Shit, I wish I was. Coat smells like somebody really peed in it. Peed on him, probably. <laughs> Very funny, Kowalski. Very funny. You know, next time I'm going to sit in the car and you're going to play the wine on. You want to know why? Because I'm going to piss all over your leg before we start. <laughs> Shit. Schmuck makes a pee coat or something to pee on. All right, all right. Cut the crap. You see anything yet? Hey, maybe these turkeys changed their mind. Maybe they're not coming. Listen, I'm going to change positions, okay? Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, we'll, uh, we'll just hang in here for a few more hours, okay? Dead and stinking here. I think I joined the police force because of all the action. You joined because you want to get away from your ugly old lady. Hey, don't you like my fist to join your face? <laughs>
Dave. Dave, can you hear me? Frank. Frank, come in. Are you there? Come in. Come in. Pete, you see anything? Come on. Give him five more minutes, then we go in. Gordon, the fire's coming down now. God damn it, somebody come in! place like this to do business. The window! It's going down this way. for a backup. I better get an ambulance. Oh, hurry. He's dead. Who is he? Goldie Jackson. Push him. Not anymore.
Hey. You okay? Hey, man, where the hell you been? I'm running my ass off. You scratched all three. What happened to Goldie Jackson? Uh, he's dead too, man. I, uh, I chased him about a half mile. Man, when you get in the mood, you don't know how to quit, do you? I figure it's three or four million on the street. Not bad for a night's work. Hawks ought to be happy. The thing I can't figure is where the hell is the money? What do you mean? Me and they were going to buy the stuff with. Not here. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Angie Post. Tell her, man. Tell her, man. All right. Frank? Yes, Frank. Horowitz. There's a meeting at Parks' office tomorrow. Oh, yeah? 10 o'clock. Be there. Okay, uh, I'll see you there. Goddamn money. Didn't just walk away. You sure nobody in the apartment could have taken it? No way. We were there within seconds of the shooting. People had just started coming out of their apartments now. Somebody had picked up that dough. We would have seen them. What we found was the dope. I mean, we turned the place upside down. We didn't find any money and we didn't take it. Buck's worth a scare. It's got to be worth something. It's got to be money somewhere. I saw the money in the window, man. Some dudes were counting it. Yeah. 
Billy Jackson had some sort of a briefcase when he went in. Well, what happened to it? I don't know. Well, maybe, uh, maybe Goldie took it with him. The heaven? The dude didn't have anything on him when I shot him. You know, the two cops who picked up the call confirmed that. I don't know, a million bucks, it just doesn't disappear. It's got to be somewhere. You sure you checked everything? Everything. We checked the fire escape, the staircase, the hallway, the basement. We even checked the alleyway. Nothing. It's just not there. Well, you know what this looks like, don't you? You're saying I took it? Nobody's saying you took it, right? I'm just saying that's what it looks like. I'm going to tell you one more time. I saw the money through the window. Shooting started. I lost track of it. Now, if you don't believe me, tough shit. I'm not going to file my report until tomorrow morning. In the meantime, that money better turn up. And if it doesn't, Coslow is here. I'll show him in. Follow me, gentlemen. Come on. No. I think I'll stay right here. That's so important. We got trouble. What kind of trouble? There was a bust. Both mother and that stupid Goldie got wasted. We lost the money and the stuff. What happened? I don't know exactly yet. The heat was waiting for them. Somehow they found out. Some creep must have talked. Well, you find out who it is. Because I want him. And you'll have him, Mr. Mayfield. Not just dead, Coslow. I want this mother crucified. Yes, baby. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am Angie of Angie and Mills. It's a great pleasure and honor to introduce Ramsey Dawes. Ramsey Dawes. if you need strokes. So I'll be back shortly. Got to be money 
someone. I know your buck's worth a scare. I know your buck's just didn't disappear. It's got to be someone. Billy Jackson had some sort of a briefcase when he went in. Didn't just walk away. Maybe Goldie took it with him. The dude didn't have anything on him when I shot him. Man, you fucks, it just doesn't disappear. It's gotta be somewhere. It's gotta be some money. Goldie had it. It just looks like that. You're saying I took it. I saw the money through the window. The shooting started. I lost track of it. Bev, we're both here for the same reason. What's that? The money. Parks made me come down here again to look for it. Thinks maybe Goldie had it, and you just didn't see him. Figures maybe he ditched it while you were chasing him. Yeah, I had the same idea, but I already looked. Did you find anything? No. Well, I'll give a look around. Maybe somebody saw something. Yeah, but even if they did, nobody talks to the cops anyway. I don't know. I'll try anyway. Frank, I just want you to know, I think you got a raw deal, and if there's anything I can do, just let me know, okay? Yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah, 
Sit down, Frank. No thanks, I have to first stand. Now get right to the point, Hooks. Internal Affairs is concerned about the disappearance of the money from last night's bus. We've decided to investigate the whole affair. We don't want anybody shouting corruption and accusing the department of covering up. You get every opportunity to clear yourself. Nobody's making any accusations. Sounds to me like the verdict is already in. No, that's not the case at all, Hooks. It's just that the department's in an awkward situation. We have to be careful in a case like this. Let's cut the crap off. Let's get down to it. Under the circumstances, Frank, uh, until the situation is all cleared up, uh, we, Eternal Affairs, suspending you from duty. That's great. Now, you continue to get pay and get your benefits. That's real decent of for the time being, we've decided not to release the story to the papers, so you don't have to worry about that. It might show the department in a bad light. I mean, that's it, isn't it? That's really it. You don't give a damn about me. You're only concerned about what the newspaper has to say. Now, I know how you feel, but... Bullshit! How could you know how I feel? You all think I'm guilty anyway. Well, that's not true. Bullshit! Look, it's nothing personal, Frank. You'll get every chance to clear yourself. The department's behind you 100%. Sure. As far as the department is concerned, Guilty till proven innocent. Well, I tell you what, huh? Screw you. Screw the department. Frank. Frank, it's uh, procedure. I want your gun for the interim. Frank Hooks. 
called me dirty. He said if I give him some information every now and then, he let me go. He ain't like <laughs> I didn't have any choice. Well, next time you'll be more careful. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, bro. Maybe you ought to run. I might change my mind. Oh, man, come on. Come on, come on, man. Come on. You said you were going to let me go, man. Should have run faster. What you doing? You said you were going to let me go. Come on. Wait, wait, hold on. Come on, man, don't do that! Hey, 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 hey! Wait, hold on, brother, wait. No, man, come on. Come on, brother, no, man! No, man! No, no! Excuse me, Mr. Mayfield. Are you ready for your karate lesson today? Nah, I don't feel like it. Why don't you just walk the dog, okay? Yes, sir. Done, Mr. Mayfield. What'd you find out? His name was Cheech. He was talking to some narc from Washington and a cop. The cop who blew away mother and Goldie. Frank Hooks. Hooks? It gets better. I did some checking. The money from the bust is missing. What do you mean? The cops can't find it. Internal Affairs is investigating hopes. They think he took it. You sure about this? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Well, if Hooks has it, I want it back. Maybe he won't want to give it to us. Well, then, my dear Coswell, we'll just have to persuade him. Move out, move out. Coming through. Coming through. Move out. We got the call. Yeah, it's a body. What happened? Somebody messed him up real bad. Whoever did it really enjoyed their work. They just cut off his peck and stuffed it in his mouth. Shit. Is that what that is? I think I'm going to throw up. There's no identification on the body. You know him? His name's Cheech Jones. Small time pusher and junkie. It's real disgusting. Frank, this is Detective Kowalski. Yeah, buddy. Your stoolie Cheech was killed last night. If he talked, he might be next. I'd be careful, Frank. These guys are serious. Okay, okay uh, thanks. I'll be on the lookout. Tell Davis I'll be at the club. Of course I'm 21, man. I got a call right here. Look at this, man. Hey, Frank, how are you? got the money. We want it back. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't be stupid. We are not fooling around. We'll be in touch soon. What now, Coslo? Now we wait. Leave so soon? I was hoping you'd leave the rest of the group. Just come on in. Got a lot of important things on my mind. Do I just take a walk? Fine, just make sure you just walk. Don't get hit by a car. Okay?
just hired you, man. And need an ambulance. I'm hurt. I'm hurt. Uh, Mayfield. Now, Mayfield. Who was in the other car? Man. Who was in the other car? I'm hurt. Punk, who's in the other car? Coslo. Young boy. Coslo. Base? Yes? This is Detective Hooks. I need you to run a mech on Coslow. He's one of Cal Mayfield's boys. I need an address on it. Can you hold a minute? Yeah, yeah, I'll hold. Hello? Detective Hooks? Hello? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. Is that K-O-S-L-O? -O? Yeah, Coslow. Nothing on a Coslo. Nothing on him, huh? Sorry, nothing. All right, try Jumbo. Jumbo? Yeah, Jumbo. We have a Jumbo Allen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's it. 9342 Cottage Grove. OK. Got that? Yeah, I got it. Have a nice day. Thank you. Jumbo. We don't know no goddamn Jumbo. Who the fuck are you? Stand up. Brother. Don't be stupid. You stand. Man, look. Jumbo ain't here. I ain't lying. He ain't here. Thank <laughs> you. 
Try to blow me away tonight. Name's Jumbo. The chief knew you were shooting up everything over here. Your ass would really be in a sling. I don't give a shit about Chief Parks. It's my ass or theirs. You understand? Frank. Clean yourself up. You're bleeding all over the city streets. Look, you were lucky tonight. But your luck just ran out. If you don't believe me, why don't you look out the door? Who is it? Frank, I want to know what the hell's going on. I always knew you were a smart car, folks. Look, bring the money in the morning to 150th and Halstead Street. And no tricks. Or next time, it won't be the cat. He's all yours. house for a few days, okay? I'll explain it all to you later. It's important that you leave now.
Don't worry about me, okay? Everything's gonna be fine. This time I'm really serious. I wanna stay. You know I really believe you this time. Please. for your crap. Oh, come on, man. Give me a break. Just because I did a little time for possession of explosives. You can't figure you can bust in here anytime you want. Well, I want to see a warrant. Here's my goddamn warrant, you understand? Now, either you cooperate, man, I'll do the hustle all over your goddamn face. Jesus Christ! You don't ask for much! That's the bullshit, man! I get it! What are you trying to do? Start a war or something? It's downstairs! Okay. Let me show you what I got here. Uh, these are smoke bombs. Uh, and I got some of these. Uh, Army. Fragmentation grenade. We don't It's a professional secret. How many you want? Five, six. Okay. Oh, this is my baby here. Nine millimeter Luger. Thirty round clips. Five, six hundred rounds per minute. You can wipe out a whole tax force with this. I'm sorry. Uh, anything else, Pointer? Yeah, just tear gas. Tear gas? Me? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Man, I get dressed. Get dressed. Come on with me. I sure hate to be on your shit list. Come on. Hey, man, this is crazy. I ain't no cop. Shut up. Get in the goddamn car. Holy shit. What are you trying to do? Invade Russia? Get in the car.
Trust me. You let him go. It's far enough, baby. Okay, Hoops. The money. The money, Hoops. I'll kill him now. I want that briefcase. You can't do anything about it. You can't bust him and you know it. The system is, Frank. You know how the system works. He'll slip and we'll get him. Well, I'm not part of the system. I got kicked out for breaking the rules, remember? How'd you like my present, Mayfield? Hooks, your ass is grass. You're dead. Yeah. That's just what I had in mind for you. <laughs> you kind of creepy is. God damn it, Lawrence! It's crazy. God damn him! Don't worry about a thing. Everything will be okay. 
All right, Gerard, you forgot something. Go back to the car again. There's something else in the car, Gerard. Go, go, just get it out of the car. Put it in the fair, will you? Put the dog in, okay? Go ahead. Don't worry, baby. Everything's going to be okay. Get it out, Gerard. Get it out. Just get it out of the car, okay? Go ahead. Don't worry, baby. Everything's going to be okay. Just go that way, Gerard. Okay, baby. Everything's okay. Okay, Hooks, what the hell do you want? I don't have your money, Mayfield. And if anything happens to Angie, I'm coming after you, and I'll get to you. I promise you that. Bye, Mayfield. Oh, this guy is crazy. Okay, raise these windows and get me the hell out of here. Let me 
follow in your light, love. When things are closing in, yeah, when everything's in doubt, when I'm feeling trapped, just be there to help me 